Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel Ray and today I have another Diamond Art Club unboxing. This is a sneak peek for tomorrow and this is called Magnolia Moon. This is a round drill diamond painting and look how beautiful it is. Nice and minimal, beautiful flowers and a moonlit sky. 55.8 by 42.6 centimeters. And we're just going to get right into it. I hope everyone is having a fantastic day. Oh, it's stuck. We've got the toolkit and the sticker. And then we have the diamond painting in here. We'll pop the box down so you can see. There we go. And I'm going to go through this quickly. This in the toolkit, it comes with everything that you might need to start diamond painting if this is your first. And like I say, if it's your first, go ahead and check the description if you'd like to get a discount. I am an affiliate. You can use the code if you like, if it's not your first time, or if you don't want to, that's okay too. I totally understand. So first thing I've pulled out here is the tray for your diamonds. Some washi tape to go around the edges of the painting or to do the sectioning off. You can check out my sectioning off how-to video. Um, I've got some multi-placers and a cover minder, this beautiful little pink daisy. Then we've got a squishy that's going to match the pen that's in here. And there's a bag full of baggies in there as well. Just everything that you need. Some, some pink wax, the drill tray, you know, anything that you might need. Then we've got the diamond painting itself, which is in this dust sleeve. This is a nice, like, manageable even travel size, I dare say, diamond painting. I'm gonna slide out the diamonds here so that we have the diamonds like this. There's AB diamonds in there. I'll show you those in just a minute in detail. We have a thank you. This also has instructions on how to diamond paint and another coupon code for your next purchase. And then we have the legend. This is like a little walking legend. And as you can see, these are stickers. So you can place these on your organizers. And uh, there's 34 colors in this painting. And it looks like we have a special drill here. And we have two AB diamonds as well. Now, let's get into it. Might have to pull out the camera so that you can see it. I was hoping it would fit into the screen, but let's go out a little bit. Ready? Wow, look at that. That's so nice. I know that a lot of you were looking for diamond paintings that were a little bit smaller and, you know, more manageable a little less <laughs> huge um, and a little less focus on like cartoons. So this is a good option. Uh, this would make an excellent gift as well because the round drills, the difference between the round drills and the square drills is that round drills really sparkle a lot. The new Diamond Art Club square drills also sparkle quite a lot, but uh, the round drills are known for their shimmer and their shine and their sparkle. And here I can show you the drill field. This is what it looks like. So you can see there's super faint gray lines to show you where to put those diamonds, but they're much fainter than they used to be. And then here you can see what those symbols look like in the flowers. Very easy to read, very easy to read. Uh, that's why I love working on Diamond Art Club canvases. Canvases, I can speak. I'm gonna show you what these drills look like. If you'd like to skip ahead, you can by all means. Look at all these beautiful colors here. We've got the darker colors in the background, but then we've also got all of these purples and pinks. Lots of shades of color. That's a lot of color for such a small painting and such a you know small scope. There's quite a lot of color changing in here, but it's not confetti heavy necessarily. So let's go ahead and see 
from the beginning what we've got going on here. Can you see the sparkle already? It's so pretty. So we've got 318, 414, 3865. This is Z3865, which I'm guessing. <gasps> These are the new fairy drills. The fairy dust. <gasps> I've never had them before. Look at that. So these have glitter in them. Can you see that? Do you see the glitter? I thought for a second they were glow in the dark. That's not showing them off very well. Look at that glitter. Oh, that is so pretty. Oh my goodness. Oh, I love them. I've never gotten them. That's so cool. We have 3371, which we have two bags of. We have 317, the 838, 415, there's two bags as well for the sky. 310, just one. 762, 413, 917, 3805, 666, and 844 in that strip. And then if we move on, we have 3834, 321, 3041, 907, look at that bright green. 600, 603. Here's an AB, this is 124, and I keep getting questions on AB. AB means Aurora Borealis, that's what it stands for. And do you see that iridescent coating on the diamonds? It's like a mirror. That is what the AB is about. It's like this little coating on it that makes it metallic and pretty and stands out up on the, on the painting. I'll show you where those go here in a second. We've got 718, 3837, 327. 3608, 891, 159, 963. Here's another AB. It's 134. See that? You can really see the metal look on this one. It's very pretty. 3799, 209 with a couple stragglers. 498, 155, and 3836. Let's go ahead and see if we can find these ABs. Number one is the pink, and that is highlighting in the in the flowers. You can kind of see it here, just this little light, light bits of pink here, down here in the in the reflection a little bit, and in each of the flowers. Most of the flowers have that pink AB. Then we have the green AB, and that is symbol number two. That is obviously very close to the flowers because this is representing some leaves, some greenery that's attaching to these branches here. Just a little bit, just a hint. And then we have the the new fairy dust diamonds, which is the little dot. So each of these little, you know, specks of white that you see, those are all the fairy dust. And also the moon and the moon's reflection. All of that is a fairy dust diamond. And then we have highlights within the flowers as well. So all of the white that you see in between the flowers, these magnolias, all of that is a fairy dust diamond too. How pretty. This is going to be so amazing once it's complete. And I think that this would be a really good project for... Um, for people who love to multi-place, for people who like to do paintings quickly, this would be a very quick finish, I think. So let me know what you think down below in the comments. Don't forget to get this, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you soon in my next video. Take care, stay safe, and I'll see you soon. Bye!